Hey, we are back with Professor Avril Merli, and this time on the subject of legislation, and if you would be asked to change the Constitution or offer a different solution to improve the society and the underdog, especially? Well, certainly the right to bear, attend to use technology, to use the equipment which is necessary in the modern age to survive. Because no one can be asked to survive in a play in, according to the rules which have been given and, uh, and, and the rules are not necessarily accommodating of the differences which exist in society. So that's, that's almost a form of torture. So certainly uh, the, the inst- to legislate uh, to, for the rights for, uh, I- for individuals to use the instruments necessary to survive, I think uh, uh, that that would be w- one of the first things on my list. What else? Oh, what else? Well... What else? Uh, what is bothering I, you in the uh, existing system? Right. I, it's bothering me the uh, the use of a power, and and the abuse of power, and then the cynical abuse of power, and then the corrupt use of power, and uh, and all the variations of that. W- without the checks and balances which are required whilst obviously there are many checks and balances the the damage done to people in the meantime it's really significant and the the secondary damages the circumstances which this system puts people in it, it creates a domino effect and we don't we we talk about this in a in a very unclear way, but if one has an image of how energy reverberates, just an analogous to energy in the universe uh, rippling, uh, rippling through space, there is an effect, and it's having an effect on society, and the remedies are very, very quick. In this day and age, there is no reason whatsoever for government to be using antiquated methods because this is causing direct uh, damage to its citizens it not only is it causing direct damage to the citizens it's causing damage disproportional to the services that they're offering which can't be offered now by free markets